Fleet at Mercy Flight, Western New York, is growing. The organization is celebrating a new helicopter, one that will carry a late pilot's legacy on every mission. The aircraft is dedicated to Mercy Flight pilot James Sauer. He died alongside a flight instructor last April when their helicopter crashed on a training mission in Genesee County. The NTSB says the investigation into that crash is still ongoing 13 months later. Tonight, our Michael Schwartz shows us this new helicopter wrapped with memories of Sauer. Good evening. Well, this is Mercy Flight 9, now dedicated to veteran pilot Jim Sauer. He and a Bell flight instructor were tragically killed in a training crash last year. This is the first Mercy Flight helicopter that has been introduced since that crash and one that will carry on Sauer's legacy to serve. You really can't say too many good things about him. I don't know, you know, for anybody that's ever seen his resume, um, he was a guy that was just dedicated to helping others uh, and, and loved flying. Um, so he was a huge asset for us. Sauer joined Mercy Flight in 2020 after serving our country with pride in Afghanistan and Desert Storm. He was also a state police civilian pilot and member of the Army National Guard, logging more than 6,100 hours of flying. Let's dedicate this bird to Jim. Sauer's widow, siblings, children, and grandchildren all watched as the door opened to reveal the helicopter that Mercy Flight will now use to save lives, just as Sauer did time and time again. His wife and brother telling me that Sauer used to often say, the office is small, but the view is beautiful. That quote on the passenger side door of Mercy 9. Sauer's grandchildren, Gavin and Olivia, got to climb inside the helicopter dedicated to their grandfather. Also taking a seat inside, this puppy, meets Sauer, named after the late pilot. She belongs to a Mercy Flight pilot. Mercy Flight 9 is expected to take to the skies as early as next week, continuing their mission to save lives. Michael Schwartz, 7 News, Chictawaga.